Hello everyone, happy Tuesday, and I'm back to share my finds from Dollar Tree, uh, Target, Hobby Lobby, and Joann's. I didn't find much at Hobby Lobby and Joann's, but I'm still going to share with you what I did find. But I think a week ago I had went to my local Dollar Tree, and I had found these cute butterflies. I normally wouldn't buy butterfly stickers, but I just like this color green. It reminded me of some Heidi Swap green little bows that I have. So I got two of those. And then I got these crowns here. I'm sure you all seen them. Everybody's been hauling these. I got them in clear. And then I got two in pink. Uh, I got the last two that they had. The pink's pretty. And I normally wouldn't buy bling anymore since I have a whole drawer full that I never use. And then I got these uh, red stars only because they were there. That was the only one. And then I found three of these here. These animal stickers. So, so cute. I just love all the little animals. That skunk is so cute. I just love anything with little animals. So I got those three. And then I found some little monkeys. I was surprised to see these at my Dollar Tree last week. And I went um, yesterday. And they don't have any more of these. And they haven't put out any new stickers. And I found these. Love that little panda. The, the little zebra. And the little giraffe. So I wish they would have had another one of these. And then I picked these owls up for a friend that I know she loves owls. They were there, so I just got them. I had no intentions of keeping that. And then over the weekend, I went to a totally different area on the other side of town. i never been to. They had so many stores all in one plaza, so that was a good thing. So I had to pick up this cute little bag because there was no sense in going in and out of the car parking in every different store and this was only a dollar they had the valentine ones but i didn't like them i didn't want any of these and i just thought this pink zebra was good so every store we went into i was just throwing my bags in there and then uh, like i said i went to a dollar tree that i never ever been to and i found these guitar tapes here <laughs> They had maybe six of these hanging, but this was the only print that I like because I already have all of them. And I have this one as well, but I love, love those hearts. So I picked this up and I asked the lady there if she had any um, Valentine washi tape or Easter. And she said, no, this was all they had. But we walked to the whole store and we didn't find anything. And I talked to the manager at my Dollar Tree yesterday and I asked him, you know, what's up with the washi tape? Because he already knows me there. <laughs> he already knows what I go in there for and it's mostly the washi tape. And every time he sees me walk in, I ask him, I'd go like this to him, do you have the little washies? And he nods his head no. And I asked him, you know, what's up with our Dollar Trees here in Texas? I've been to so many Dollar Trees with no washi. He say he don't know what's going on. But that he has not seen any washi tape. And he told me when it comes in, I'm going to hold some for you. He is so sweet. He knows I have a thing for washi tape. Even though I don't buy all of them, he always, always holds two strips for me when he can. He's so sweet. But anyway, I got this pin here. I just thought it was so cute. Love, love the little pom-pom. They had them in this color. Uh, I don't really remember all the other colors, but I just wanted to get one in pink. I don't need all of them. And then I found these cute Minnie Mouse crayons. I just thought these were so cute when I opened them to look at the color. They look so wax, like they're so full of wax. But this is the color that I really like because you could use this color this uh, particular color like a light peach color to color your stamp images or your prima dolls and I just thought these colors were cute they had a little I think a little diary with the pen I had it in my hand it was so cute but I put it back because those little journals I don't like that it comes with that cheap looking paper and when you write, it tears or if you glue something or barely put it. just, I already had experience with those. So 
I just thought these colors were cute and I wanted to get them. So that's how I got a Dollar Tree, guys. That, oops, everything's falling. I have a little table here and it's not a good idea. <clears throat> and then they had a party city and the babes wanted to get some Super Bowl um, bowls and for the chips and stuff. So they, and right when we walked in, this was a big party city. They had a whole wall full of clearance stuff. And I spotted these two. These, these two washi tapes are not a washi print I would normally get, really, guys. And I did put them back. And they had the one that said caution. And I put them back. And the babe said, why are you putting those back? They're only 50 cents. Just get them. And I said, nah, I don't really. I don't want no skulls. And he said, they're only 50 cents. Just get them. So I went ahead and got them. But I'm pretty sure I'm going to pass these along. Because I don't know, I just don't think I will use them. I never been fond of skulls, not even all that Dia de los Muertos, all that stuff that goes on. I just really never liked that stuff. They're 50 cents, so I got them. Then we went to Target. Oops. Oh my goodness. Sorry, guys. Then we went to Target because I was on a hunt for those $2.99 Scotch washi tapes. I found the display, of course, it was all empty. So, I was so sad about that. <laughs> so, I went straight to the Valentine stuff. And I finally found the heart tissue paper. This was $1.50. And I knew I wanted to get this when I had found that little uh, Spellbinder die a Tuesday morning. This was what I thought of to do to cut them up with some of this. So, I picked that up. And then we walked to the dollar bins. And they had a few Easter stuff at this Target. So I got this cute, cute little stamp here. And you can tell the rubber in the back. It's not good quality. And then I got this one here. But, I mean, yeah, I think it'll do the job. I didn't do a demo or stamp them or anything. I think it's dirty. But I think these are the only two they had. And I think they had one with little feet. The little rabbit feet marks. I didn't want that. There's one that says Happy Easter. I love, love that font. I'm after that one, and I'm sure I'll find it at mine's. As a matter of fact, I went to my Target yesterday, and they don't have no Valentine's. So it was a hot mess, but there was a gentleman there. He had a box, and then he was getting ready to hang some stuff, and then one of the other managers said, you need to look at the numbers on the boxes, and I happened just to glance, and on the box it said 214. February 14, they're supposed to put that box out. So the guy and him were going back and forth about it. It looks like he was getting ready to hang some Easter items. It was some shape of an egg or then he started getting them off the peg. So I don't know. I walked away because it was just a hot mess. I mean, bins were all mixed up with all kind of stuff. Then I walked to the stationery. I didn't see anything that caught my eye. So I literally walked out of Target. Did I get in line and buy something? I know I bought something. I can't remember what I bought. Or did I end up walking out? Oh, I wanted to get an avocado. And they were no good. So, yeah, I did end up walking out. But anyways, guys, I went to Hobby Lobby. I'm after the Valentine's washi tape. This was the only one that I could find. This is the one I didn't really want to get. But since it was there, and it was kind of ripped up already. Like somebody, I guess... It was kind of torn, but it's okay. I mean, I fixed it, and I mean, I'm going to fix it and just nip it off there. This was the only one that was hanging. I really, really wanted the one that says love with the gold and the heart. That's the one I really wanted. So I got stuck with just this one, but it's okay. And then I got this. This is another Sizzik die set that I wanted. I don't remember who hauled this in one of their hauls i said oh my god i gotta have that for the little banners perfect perfect for planners and i used the coupon and i cut them all out guys to share with you look how pretty they are i did it in pink so you can really see them love love the little bows and then that little banner set there which one is it uh this one it reminds me of a pizza <laughs> So pretty. I think it's so worth buying this die, especially with all these little banners that you could use. So I knew that I wanted this, 
and the Valentine's washi tape. That's all I wanted to get. I didn't even look at the stickers. Um, but I did look at the paper. And oh my goodness, guys. <laughs> Hobby Lobby still has this romance novel. I mean, I've had this, never used it. And then I seen the uh, I seen this one here as well. I have all of these Prima <laughs> paper pads. I got every single one, I think. I don't know, four or five years ago. And they still had these. I was so surprised. Like, when are they going to really, really <laughs> change up for their Prima paper pads? And I swear, guys, I never used any of these paper pads. <laughs> Those are the Prima ones that I have in 6x6. And then I still have this one from Tuesday morning. This is a Prima. And I have two. I have bought three of these. I gave one away a long time ago, and then I still have this one. It's so crazy that Hobby Lobby will have the same paper pads for more than five years. And I know that they're known for that. I've been shopping at Hobby Lobby for years. <laughs> I just thought it was so funny when I seen that uh, Prima paper pads. I'm like, God, oh, those are old. But anyways, um, then I found this Heidi Swap Mink for $1.79. And these are the prints you get in the back. I'm loving buying all this stuff. And I'm glad I'm getting it on clearance. <laughs> so I'm stocking up. But the only thing is I think I need the bigger foil sheets for these. Because I found this one as well. And this one has the camera and the ad percent sign. Love, love that. These are only $1.79. They had one more but I didn't really care for it. So I left it for $1.79. And regular was $4.99. And I went to my Michaels yesterday, and their long foil sheets are $9.99. They had three on clearance, three colors for $3.99, but they were all gone. So I got to go back and check when they're going to be clearancing out those longer ones or go to a different Michaels, I guess, just to get two or three of the longer ones. I'm not sure the short ones are going to fit. So that's how I picked up at Hobby Lobby, guys. Then I went to Joann's. I didn't find anything that I wanted new. This Joann's, I don't know. I, they didn't even have Teresa Collins uh, in the store. And I was shocked because normally all Joann's carry some of her stuff. But I did find this cute washi tape. And those are the prints you get. You get two rolls. You don't get that much. So I picked up two of these because they were only a dollar. And they had the word love. And then this was 74 cents. This was the only sticker book valentine's that i found and it was just laying around on something and i got it because it has purple in it so this was laying around and when you walked in they had all the valentine stuff 50 percent off on two racks but i went through the whole racks i didn't see anything that i liked and they had those uh i had posted a picture on my instagram of those wall hangings they were 60 percent off but i ended up not getting one then I found this cute Doris St. Patrick's Day sticker book. I don't have not one book, not even from last year, because I went through all my books. And I think these are so cute. This was $1.49, and I ended up using a 50% off coupon because there was nothing else for me to use it for. So I didn't pay anything for this cute sticker book. I just like the stickers. And they had another one, but the other sticker book was full of just those clover leaves. And I didn't want to get it for that. I should have got another one of these, though. Or maybe if I go back, they'll be on clearance or something. But I just thought this was so cute. So that's all I picked up at Johan's. Then they had a five below. We went in there and OMG, guys, look how thick this coloring book is five dollars and i was dying to get a thick one when i had shared a picture on instagram of the ones that tuesday morning i think i had posted it up maybe on a saturday or sunday i had went back that wednesday and they were all gone and i should have got two they had different ones this one this particular cover here if you see it there it's not double-sided like it has a picture here that you could color and in the back it's plain see so I guess it won't bleed through so it's not double-sided 
but they have another coloring book for four dollars and that one is double sided it has pictures on both sides but i wanted to try this one first look at that they have really pretty coloring sheets in here pretty pretty prints so i chose this one and the babes got some five dollar t-shirts so that's why i only got one guys because five dollars adds up he had four shirts that was 20 plus this was 25 so no <laughs> I wasn't going to spend more than that, so uh, I just got one for now, but I'm going to try to go again because I want I see maybe two more prints that I wanted, so that's what I picked up at Five Below. Then at Michael's, oh, oh that was when I went yesterday. I'm going to show you what I had got. I think it was Friday. I went to a Michael's on the other side of town, <clears throat> and I got the Heidi Swap Mink. Uh, the covers that you put your oh I thought I had opened it the clear sheets that you put your uh, foil item in and you run it through the machine this was only a dollar 49 guys I was so happy to find that and then I found this cute pen I love the way these pens write I have the valentine one that I just bought XOXO oh I love the way it writes and I'm hoping this one writes the same way which i'm pretty sure it will then to my surprise guys these were marked down to 129 these cute little emmanuel dots and i love love these so i got to get four i got the last four that they had for a dollar 29 then i found this pack here um the heidi swap for the meat these were I think these were 129 and then I got three of these foils here these colors here these were a dollar 99 for those I'm pretty sure then this was 50% off and this was the last one so I went ahead and got it just to have because <laughs> I did find the other paper collection and then this one is the other one that I found, the other Meek. These were, uh, I don't know, these are $129 or $199. I can't remember. And then this one here. So I got that. And then I found this card set. I already have the polish and the perfumes. And I thought this one was cute. So I got that one. And then I got some of the $199 washi tapes. I got these prints here. Well, I got two of the same. I love, love that, uh, this leaf one there. So, I just got that to add to my collection, guys. Then, in the clearance aisle, this was so old, guys. Remember these sets? I, I don't know if this came out last year or the year before. I don't know if you could see it, but it says... OMG, Rad, Fantastic, LOL, and then it has an arrow. Uh, these are old, and it was on clearance for $1.99, but I said there's no way they still have this. So I went to the scanner, and it scanned for $0.42. Cents. So it's stamped, so I got it. I thought that was a good deal. Then I went by Michael's yesterday, the one by my house, just to see if they had any new Valentine stuff because, you know, I'm after those stamps. And I found the red color mink. This was $1.99. And I got this color because I got went ahead and got this paper pad here. And I thought it would match something red. This was, I think, $2.99. And then I got the little um, embellishment pack. But I think there's a lot of the same, like love, kiss, the hearts. It's... um. 40 pieces so i don't know how many of each you get but i thought it was all mixed up but it, i think it matches pretty good with that and then i got this one here this was 129 yesterday i remember that and then they had these mambi hap the happy planner mambi clips i have been wanting this but you're supposed to get nine, and I counted there's only eight. There's, so there's one missing, guys. If I was to make my own happy planner, I don't know if it's okay that I have one missing. Somebody that has a happy planner, let me know, because there's a happy planner punch that Diane showed. Paper uh, punch where you could do the pages, 
I knew they were going to come out with one. I knew it. So when I seen her show that, I knew these were on clearance at Michael's for $1.79. So I wanted to make my own, but I'm missing a ring. I don't know if I should take it back because this was the only black one. The gold ones are not on clearance yet. They're $4.99. But this was the only pack that I found yesterday, but there's one missing. So somebody tell me if I could get away with not having one or not. Then I found the Heidi Swap washi tape this was the only one is 40 percent off because i would never pay 4.99 for a washi tape but it was 40 percent off so i went ahead and got it which i didn't even want to get it i didn't even want to pay 2.99 for that but all the valentine stuff is literally almost gone they have a few items left everything was 50 percent off yesterday so that's all i picked up guys so I'm going to close this video, guys. So thanks, everyone, for watching. Take care, and I'll see you in the next video.